Jessa Duggar has been slammed by fans for letting her kids color on her brand new cabinets. The former reality star shared a video of the progress of her renovations in her messy home. Jessa shared part 4 of a video called Fixer Upper on her YouTube channel on May 30th. During the nearly 18 minute long video, she shows off her kitchen, which is not completed. The camera shows off her cabinets and an incomplete window, with tools sitting on top of the counter. Okay. Another thing here. I stained all these doors here and I was going to seal them and one of my kids got a hold of a sharpie, she explained. I did the not smart thing that moms do sometimes and left this here. So one of my little ones was like oh color, she went on. Jessa then films the cabinet door, which has sharpie marks around the edges. You can see this here, just a complete circle around the whole thing and some extra little swirlies over here. You know what I'm debating. First I was a little frustrated like why, but then I was like you know what? Maybe it'll add some character, Jessa added. I am seriously thinking of just leaving it and Polly over top of it and it'll be a keepsake, the counting on alum explained. I could just sand the whole thing down and start all over again, she sighed. But maybe I don't feel like doing that. And it's all right. This is real life, you know? Life is messy sometimes. It's not picture perfect. The cabinet may just be a permanent part of our house decor. We'll see, she ended. Jessa also admitted that she is not always calm about things like that, but is trying to learn to let things go. Her followers had suggestions for her and some even slammed her in the comments. Many of them agreed that she should sand the door down. I recommend sanding down the sharp door. Leaving it leaves the wrong message for the kids and future kids. I love that you want to include their doodling in the decor but perhaps have them doodle on canvas and then hang them somewhere they can admire their work," one fan suggested. Sand the island door to get rid of the sharpie otherwise it will irritate you and you'll eventually do it and it may not match your other doors," said another. Use the cabinet door as a life lesson have all the kids help to get it off explaining why no one should write on furniture or walls. The dry eraser shouldn't take long, suggested a third. Another commenter wrote, the sharpie might be a good natural consequences lesson. Have the child who drew it help you fix it. To whatever extent is age appropriate. Jessa, 29, and her husband, Ben Seewald, 27, are renovating a home owned by Emmanuel Baptist Church, where he works as a pastor. It is still under construction after the ex-reality stars dumped their savings into fixing it up. In exclusive photos obtained by The Sun, the home continues to be under construction one year after the remodel started. The snaps of the home, which is located directly next to the church in Springdale, Arkansas, previously showed there were still construction supplies on the front porch. The front porch appeared to be unfinished, as the two wood beams were not painted or stained. There was also a construction truck parked outside of the home. The house boasts four bedrooms and two bathrooms. Arkansas property records reveal the house is still owned by the church located in Springdale. The home was built in 1950 and the church purchased the abode in 1985. Jessa and Ben married in 2014. They share four children together sons Spurgeon, six, and Henry, five, and daughters Ivy, three, and Fern, ten months.